In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate a proportion of cars traveling between two scores, or between, in this case, 60 and 75 miles per hour. So um, what we're trying to do is we're trying to find the scores between 60, so just above, you know, the mu or zero for z, right? And then not quite to one standard deviation uh, above the mean. So we're looking for just this area right here. So the proportion of cars in this um, range for, for speed, right? Okay, so we're going to use our z equation again. And again, z equals x minus mu divided by standard deviation. So let's start with the lower end first. Let's use um, the, the, the speed, right, of 60. Let's do that one first. So we're going to go um, 60 minus, and the average score or average um, miles per hour is 58. Right, minus standard deviation of 10. Okay, so um, 2 divided by 10. So the z on the lower end that we're looking at is a positive, but 0 0.2, it's just barely positive. Okay, and let's do the same thing over here with the upper score of um, 65 miles an hour, right? Again, minus 58 of the um, average, and then 10 standard deviations. And so now we have 7 divided by 10. Right? or um, z equals um, positive 0.7. Okay? Get out your unit normal table and look up the z, or the proportion that falls in the tail, um, for uh, z equaling 0.2 and 0.7. Okay, so that proportion on the smaller end, right, is um, 0.0793. And over here on the upper end, the ones that were going a little bit faster, right, 0.2580, okay? So what I want to do then is find, again, the proportion of cars that were traveling between 60 and 75 miles an hour. All I need to do is add these two together, right? So 0 0.0793 plus the proportion of the ones going, um, you know, a little bit faster, right, um, 0 0.2580, and I get 0 0.3373, or in um, percentages, right, 33.73%. So what I can say is that um, 33, about a third of the cars, um, you know, were, were traveling between 60 and 65 miles per hour.